What the motherfuckers, Mr. Mad in this bitch? Coming at you, bring a god and then a motherfucker. So, Tyler! Uh, my god. So, uh, I've, I've heard about these in the past. This is a uh, product called uh, Miracle Berries, right? And uh, I bought two different variants of it. And basically what it does is it's some type of uh, fruit thing uh, that, that, I don't know if it originated in Africa, but basically it uh, changes the shape of your taste buds and it tricks your brain into thinking that things that are normally sour or bitter somehow end up like sweet or maybe something else. And uh, it's like, I don't know, it's, it's like a, you're supposed to go on like taste trips with it uh, so you take like a so I, I got two different forms so one comes in tablets which is just the uh miracle berry uh like powder with some cornstarch and then you just let it dissolve on your tongue then i got the actual fruit uh and let's go ahead and unbox this this is gonna be i don't know if this is an unboxing video or a taste test what is, but uh yeah miracle berries I know. I'll just some beats on these fucking things, man. And I can never rip them off properly, so there we go. So let's go ahead and uh, open these up. So this is made by, well, let's open this one up first because this is the, the original one that I heard of uh, was this brand or whatever. And so I wanted to see, because these are very expensive. These are uh, $17. And you only get 10, 10 pills or, or tablets or whatever. They say you can do a half a pill or a half a tablet, but, uh, you know, I don't know. Anytime I've seen anybody use it, uh, they've taken the whole pill. Uh, I don't know which one I'm going to use. I think I'll just use this one first. I mean, this is the actual berry itself. What they do is freeze dry it. Best by April of 2025. So, uh, we'll be all right. It's uh, April of 2024, so right now so but uh this is the freeze-dried variant uh this is i'm assuming it's the same thing because this is the powder which i'm assuming if you freeze dry it and then powderize it it's gonna be the same exact shit but these were uh 50 bucks 57 dollars for 175 though so you get 175 half berries so you get what what is it i can't do math right now but half of that, <laughs> uh, full berries. But I, I don't think, I think you could just do half and you'll be all right. So, uh, it's like a tape, it's like medical tape over here. Kind of want to get into it quick because, uh, I think it, I think it takes like a few minutes for it to like kick in. So we're, we're going to sit here, cleanse your palate. Oh, I need water. Right, let me get some water. I'll be right back. So you gotta cleanse your palate, and then you kinda gotta let the, the berry coat your tongue. And then from there, uh, I got like a little gauntlet. I, I got a little gauntlet of uh, shit here that I'm gonna try. So it's mostly just sour shit. I got some kimchi, peanut butter, I don't know. Like I, I, I know, I think what it does for sweet shit, it makes sweet shit even sweeter. So it says cleanse your palate by swishing water in your mouth. Okay, let's do that. Okay. Um, chew one to two berry halves for 30 seconds. Oh, okay. Oh, one half equals 15 to 20 minutes of flavor change. Two halves equals 20 to 40 minutes of flavor change. Reseal the package airtight immediately to preserve freshness. Done. Enjoy the new taste you get from sour food. It's not magic. It's a miracle berry. How does it work? Scientifically known as Sincepalum dulcificum. Dulcificum? Gross. Miracle fruit contains a glycoprotein called miraculin. Miraculin naturally binds to taste buds and alters their shape, which in turn makes you interpret tastes differently. Most dramatically changing low pH foods sour to sweet. Satisfy your sugar cravings without the sugar. Immediately reseal the package every time. Freeze drying is a premium chemical-free process done directly on the farm just after the berries are picked. 
Freeze dried berries can also, oh, that reminds me. I'm supposed to upload my freeze dryer video. Why my eyes look so shitty? Uh, I was freeze drying some um, uh, Skittles and Jolly Ranchers for a homeboy. And uh, I did a short of that, so keep an eye out for that. I, I, I recorded it, I just didn't compile it together and do my thing. But So I, I got a freeze dryer. So I could make my own if I knew where to find these fucking berries. All right. Uh, they absorb uh, moisture from the air, so leave the silica pack inside and reseal it every time, uh, each time. Your berries will stay fresh, dry, and delicious for at least 30 days after opening. Right. Yeah. Uh, I noticed that, actually, with my freeze dryer and shit. Um, I didn't seal it, and I didn't put the silica pack, so, like, when I went to go eat a strawberry later, kind of tasted stale. Or, like, smushy. Didn't have that nice crisp, so I think I ruined all my batches, everything. I got bananas, apples, all that shit. Well, whatever. All right, um, I think I'm going to do the pill because, um, I don't know. Yeah, I'm going to do the pill because this is the one that, that I found out about first. And uh, let me, again, clean, cleanse my palate. Ten servings. Uh, and this is the most expensive one. So I don't know. I, I want to see if uh, if these really make a difference. So I guess this will be the, the first, you know, experience with this. And uh, those. Oh. Those will be uh, oh, hermetically sealed, uh, you know. There's like medicine here, right? Um, so you got 10, 10 of these miracle berries. So you got, oh, let's see what the, th this guy says, or this guy, whoever. I think this was a shark tank thing also. Flavor tripping, that's what it says. I got my, my boarding pass, guys, don't steal my information. Uh... Healthy inside, happy outside. Okay. Believe in miracles. Share your lemon smile. Discover new flavors and create fun recipes. Chili pepper. I have, uh, I mean, just regular Frank's Red Hot. I should just get uh, some regular pepper. I, I'll do it eventually. Uh, pineapple, martini, strawberry, cheese. Ooh, cheese. I got cheese. Grape, lemon, apple. So I don't have any fresh fruits, but uh, I've got kimchi. I've got... Uh, I've got Frank's Red hot sauce. I got two different types of apple cider vinegar, one with the mother and one without. I got regular white vinegar. I got honey just to see what that's about. Uh, I've got crystallized lime, crystallized orange, and crystallized lemon. So I'm just gonna shoot them. Hopefully I don't like ruin the enamel on my teeth. I got actual, uh, well, as real of, of lemon juice as you can get. The kimchi, like I said. I got peanut butter. I don't know why. Uh, I'm going to get a piece of cheese. Let, let me eat one of these uh, shits, though. Yeah. I'm just going to pop one of these. And while I uh, go find whatever I got to get, I'm going to uh, I'm also get something spicy. Like, just spicy without vinegar in it. So I'm going to chew this up, I guess, right? Place one emberry tablet on your tongue and dissolve completely. <clears throat> Dissolve completely. I'll be right back. Oh. Mind the flavor of the actual berry itself it's not bad uh, so I got a piece of Tillamook cheese my favorite one of my favorite uh, medium cheddars and some death shots shout outs to CJ from uh, beef it to beef it no All right. I got him into this one recently so um, he's been training his capsaicin uh, tolerance with these so let me um this berry's taking a while to to do its thing the berry itself or i mean tablet itself has a um a little bit of a sour not not even sour but kind of fruity soury kind of tart tart like a 
tart cherry. Mm -hmm. All right. So let's see how this plays out. I'm kind of excited because they say like, um, well, all the videos I've seen, you know, people would eat or like drink like lemon juice straight out the thing. And I don't think that's good for your teeth. You know, you're probably going to get your teeth fucked up like that. But um, they'd say it's sweet. Like lemon, lemon juice is really sweet. Orange juice tastes like the best orange juice you've ever had. Um, like blueberries, even if they're like the shittiest supermarket blueberries that like don't... Uh, don't taste that great. Like they come out like tasting like the best fucking blueberries. Pineapples taste ultra sweet. Um, you know, strawberries, which are hit or miss. You know, a, a lot of strawberries end up being a little too tart, you know, sometimes. So maybe strawberries are going to make, you know, taste really, really good. Mm, you know, I do want to open one of these just to see what they look like here. Two or more berry heads moving everywhere throughout your mouth, then swallow I do want to eat one of these. I'll, I'll, I'll open one of these after I do my little gauntlet here. It's already 10 minutes. A berry, I mean, this thing is still taking forever to thing. <clears throat> okay. All right. Almost done. <laughs> All right. I'm just going to chew it. You can't chew it. It's hard. Pause. It's like a, a resin, like a gum. Okay. I think that's good. Let's start with the uh, start with the lemon juice. Hundred percent lemon juice from Concentrate. Let's go ahead and uh, salute. Wow, that really works. Holy shit. It just tastes like lemonade. That's fucking crazy. I still taste some sour though. Hmm. Well, let me see. I'm gonna open one of these up. Maybe because I chewed it. But it, it, it did change it. it. It is sweet. That's funny. I can still sen sense the sourness, like, you know, that same effect, but it really does taste sweet. Okay, so these are the haves and have-nots, no? All right. But this is the berry, it's tiny. This is a half, half of a berry. So I'll go ahead and chew that. Seal it right away. Um, what's next? I want to do a little bit more as lemon juice, just to see. That's fucking amazing. That is so weird. All right. Cool. Um, it didn't really coat the back of my tongue. Pause. But, um, I can sense a little bit of a, um, sourness back there. Pause. Let me try some of this white vinegar. Whereas I pronounce it vinegar, because isn't that, no? Smell it through the bag, baby. What? <laughs> that is so fucking crazy. It still burns. <clears throat> it burns my throat, but when it glides across your tongue, pause. It's sweet and it's burning my my esophagus. All right, that is fucking bananas. So regular apple, apple cider vinegar without the mother. That tastes like um. It still burns your throat though. Yeah. It soured the back of my throat. Pause. Um. Tastes like a fucking fermented apple juice. Let's try it with the mother. I'm gonna get the poops. Wow. 
Wow. This like this tastes like an apple beer. Like a beer. For real, like a beer. Yeah, I feel like I'm drinking a fucking like a very uh very hard ale or whatever. Or I mean a uh, apple beer. Need some water. Still it still burns your throat. You're not supposed to drink apple cider vinegar like that. Um, do a little taste of uh, Frank's Red Hot here. See how this is going to taste here. Mm -hmm. Nice little spoon full here. The burn is still there. <clears throat> um, I don't know what it tastes like. You still get the flavor of the pepper. I don't know. Did, did it stop working already? Mm -mm. Nope. It's weird, under my tongue, uh, yeah, I'm gonna take another one. Under my tongue, I could feel, I could sense the sourness, so maybe I gotta like distribute it under my tongue as well. Coat, coat the whole tongue. Try some kimchi. I don't know how to describe that. It just tastes normal, I think. I thought maybe like, cause it's like pickled, right? I don't know, okay, well, maybe cause it doesn't have like, yeah, this tastes normal. This tastes like regular ass, or not regular, but. I don't taste any, uh, sweetness or anything. Yeah. Um, I'm, I'm gonna use the lemon juice as like a, my, my base test because I, I know what this tastes like. Still got sweetness to it. Feels like it's fading though. All right, um, I'm gonna do lemon powder, or no, let me do orange powder, then lemon, then lime. In that order. This is crystallized orange. Orange, you glad I picked this first? No, all right. Let's stop. Down the hatch. That's a little. They don't even give you that much. Hmm. That's just good. I do taste sour, though. Kind of tastes like uh, like a sour candy. Is this worn off already? It's supposed to be 10 minutes. Maybe it's been 10 minutes. I'm starting to notice more sour. Maybe I gotta pop a couple more. I hope this doesn't fuck up my taste buds for real. But um, maybe I gotta, maybe the water fucked it up. Maybe I'm not, you know, I don't know. Start with a fresh tongue. <clears throat> Let me try two, two more of these.
Maybe the kimchi fucked it up. Right? I just got that garlic flavor from the kimchi. Mmm. Back to being sweet. It's still got a sour taste to it, though. All right, let's try lemon powder, crystallized lemon. See how that goes. Kind of weird. I know 100% my stomach's starting to hurt. <laughs> I know 100% I probably wouldn't be able to eat this powder on its own, but uh, we'll see. Wow, it's sour. You can still taste the sour, but it's nowhere near as sour as it probably would be. I still get a little bit of sour though, but I can taste the lemon oil, like the peel. Cause this has the peel as well. But it tastes like a lemon head. So that's kind of cool. I feel the acidity attacking the enamel in my teeth. Ugh. Okay. All right. So let's try it. lime powder. But it is sweet. It's weird like that. The aftertaste is still kind of like, there's a sweetness to it. So that's kind of funny. All right, lime powder. Hmm. Yeah. So. Whoop. I can still taste some sour. And I can taste the bitterness of the the lime, like the uh, the peel itself, but it's not sour. I know if I ate one of these packets, like raw dog, it would uh it would probably be very very sour, but it's decent. Mm -hmm. Um, let's try some peanut butter. <laughs> See if that makes any difference. My, my digestive tract is uh, not, not enjoying this. A little peanut butter here. I got crunchy and I got skippy because nobody likes. I didn't want to scream so loud. Nobody likes Jeff! Jeff. Nobody likes Jeff. Mmm. Weird. Got all over my lips. It's weird because ah, it's so dry. Um, you know, normally peanut butter has like a little sweetness to it by default. This somehow tasted a little bit less sweet. Still got some sweet in it, but it tastes more like just the peanuts by themselves. My nose is running. I better go catch it. No? All right. All right. Um, got some cheese. Got some more of the lemon juice. Still, still working. I'm gonna try some honey, <clears throat> just to see, just to see what's going on here. All right, relax. All right, whatever's going on out there. My flag waving, my American flag. All right. <clears throat> try some honey. 
I wonder if there's gonna be like extra sweet or it's gonna neutralize the, the sugar or the honey. No, this is regular honey. It doesn't taste as sweet, maybe. I think it has the reverse effect on sweet stuff for some reason. Because usually like a big ass spoonful of honey, I mean, I don't know. That's about the same. Maybe slightly less, I don't know. I feel like it did the same thing with the peanut butter though. It just slightly takes away, let's see. Well, now it's just gonna taste like lemonade, for, for sure, for sure. All right, whatever. Try a piece of cheese. My nose really is running, what the fuck? All right, she's had some time to soften a little bit, which is nice, I like, I like when it kind of hits room temperature, you get like, it, it opens the flavors up more of the cheese. I'm also gonna go ahead and Hmm. <clears throat> it's still cheese. It doesn't make it sweeter or anything like that, but it does kind of enhance the flavor of the cheese more than it normally is. Like it tastes better than it normally tastes, but it still tastes like regular ass cheese. Like it's not sweet or anything like that. But like the sharp, the sharpness that the cheese usually has is still there too. So I don't know. But it's like creamier. Maybe because I let it sit. I don't know. Hmm. All right. All right, so I think that's, that's everything, right? Let me try a little bit more of this beer. So crazy. I forgot what the vinegar tastes like, uh, regular apple cider vinegar. Besides it <laughs> shooting directly down my throat and burning it, it just tastes, I don't know, indescribable. <sighs> the moment y'all been waiting for. Death shots. This is, um, the essence of 10 Carolina Reapers in 190 proof ethyl alcohol. Um, so for some reason, uh, ugh, man, my stomach is gonna be doing backflips. Um, for some reason, when you put Carolina Reapers in alcohol, it, it almost like compounds. So Even though Carolina Reaper may be, I don't know, two point something million Scoville units, it seems like these get hotter than that. Or, or maybe it just uses the full potential, but I'm gonna do a couple drops of this and see what the fuck is going on in this bitch. burns my throat it did taste sweet on the tongue <clears throat> definitely kicking in it changes the flavor of the pepper a lot <clears throat> Woo. <clears throat> my throat <clears throat> pause <clears throat> <clears throat> I 
Builds up phlegm, that's for sure. Okay, now the heat's taking over. So this does nothing to uh, the heat. <clears throat> Woo, eyes watering. Back of the throat is on fire right now, pause. I haven't done a dropper full of that in a while. <clears throat> Whew, man. I got tears. <clears throat> Yeah, my mouth is burning. Oh, man. <clears throat> uh, whew, man, I forgot how hot that shit is. It's even worse when you add water. <sighs> huh. I wonder if lemon juice will make it sweet somehow. Oh, that did not help. <clears throat> wow. My eyes. <clears throat> Try some honey. Woo wee. Man, I, I lost my tolerance. That's for damn sure. <clears throat> Here we go. It does not help. Wow. <clears throat> it's a, <clears throat> such a sharp, stinging pain. <laughs> yeah, don't don't do a full dropper of uh, death shots. <clears throat> it will put you on your ass if you haven't done it in a while. If you're training, you know, it is what it is. But it's like, it's hitting me right in the amygdala. I don't, is, is that even a thing? The water does nothing. That's for damn sure. I wonder if peanut butter does anything. Does peanut butter help with heat? <clears throat> Let's see. I haven't done anything like spicy in a while. Do some death shots. If you're trying to build up a heat tolerance, I already put up uh, the homeboy uh, CJ from Texas on game. And he's probably uh, doing full droppers now, now, you know, by this point in time. Mm, what else? I got. I think that's about it. <clears throat> we try some of this. Uh, Regular vinegar again. So it's still working. Um, the effect of the miracle berry. But there's nothing for the heat. <laughs> <clears throat> My nose is fucking running. try one more thing real quick <clears throat> first i gotta blow my nose though <clears throat> i got boogers all over the place I saw these out the corner of my eye. If candy gets any better. Woo, man. All right. 
Plus, I like spicy chocolate. Uh, if, if you if you've never heard of uh, Willy, fuck, what was it, what was the name? <clears throat> Willy Pete's, I think. Uh, they make chocolate bars. Willy Pete's. Yeah, Willy Pete's Chocolate Company. <clears throat> they make some really nice, uh, spicy as fuck chocolate bars. So I figured since I had some spicy already, this is like my favorite, you know, uh, commercial candy, I guess, Reese's. <clears throat> that's, it's starting to subside that now though, so that's good. Probably all the shit that I've been ingesting. Let me see, this still works. Yeah. Okay. I hope I don't, uh, <clears throat> hope I didn't take too many. Cause I said like, it's, it, it's incremental it seems, you know, like. Two halves <clears throat> is 20 to 40 minutes of flavor change. I said what, like six plus a bill, pill? Uh oh, I think I'm in trouble today. Reese's. <clears throat> Still very sweet. My stomach is gonna be a fucking disaster. <clears throat> um, it's still sweet. I feel like again, it's 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 more decadently sweet. I don't know how do you, how do you describe it. It's not just like a sh like a regular milk chocolate sugar sweet. Now it feels like a richer and creamier, like the cheese kind of had that experience. Like it felt like more premium now, somehow. The peanut butter is still the same. <clears throat> Tastes more um, velvety, smoother somehow than regular Reese's. <clears throat> I don't know. Kind of weird. Not had Miracle Berries. I see you. <clears throat> so, shout out to Snazberry Farm <clears throat> and uh, mberry.us. Pretty cool experience, I guess. I don't know. I'm not like too blown away by it, though. I mean, it, it was it was pretty cool, but uh, I don't know. I felt like it could have. My stomach is a fucking disaster right now. I felt like it could have. Uh, like there was still notes of sourness or bitterness. You know, I thought it was gonna like. I, I thought this was gonna be like drinking lemonade, and it kind of was, but it still had like a little tartness to it. Like on the sides of your tongue or underneath your tongue, I guess. You don't even have taste buds there, but somehow it did. Obviously, when the vinegar hits your throat, pause. <clears throat> and I'm not going to pronounce it that way, especially if I'm saying that sentence. The other way. Uh, the, uh, what else? Oh, the little powders. The little powders were a little bit cooler, but you could still taste the sour. So it didn't, all, it didn't completely change it. So maybe that's a testament to just how sour those little crystallized packets are. The hot sauce kind of didn't change at all. Uh, it didn't really taste that sweet or anything like that. This was the most surprising one to me. Because I've had this in like shots. And it's a disaster, you know. But this tasted like an actual like apple beer. Like a beer. Like a fucking seriously a beer. Because it's fermented, I guess. I don't know. I mean, this should be fermented too, no? <clears throat> Raw, unfiltered? I don't know. Um, yeah, this one, uh, this one just tasted kind of like, 
a little bit of apple juice <clears throat> kind of flavor. I forget what this one tasted like. Regular white, white vinegar. Vinegar. It's sweet, but it's still vinegar. You know what I mean? And then the kimchi was just kimchi. Like it just tastes just like fucking garlic and <clears throat> ginger and all that stuff. Honey kind of got di <clears throat> diluted a little bit. And this was about the same. All right. Well, shit. That's all I got for you. Thank you all for watching and peace out.